Hey guys, it's Edgar. We're gonna be checking out Epic High. You know I got that tour merch. You know I got that tour VIP signed tour poster merch. You know I got that little fan banner. You know I got that. Okay, I saw them in this past February, I believe it was. Um, I went to the Tucson show for this last tour. Super duper fun. Really loved it. It was their first time. There's not a lot. If they hit up Arizona, it's definitely Phoenix that artists will always go to. Um, but the, but Epic High hits up so many cities. You can look right there, um, or you can look you can look right there. You can look. Um, but <laughs> and if you know, you know. Um, but it was still really really cool to go um, to Tucson for that. Um, Epic High Live is like literally something I need to every time they tour. Every time they tour, I think I have to be there every single time just because the concert is like so so fun. Oh my god, I really, really, I had a really great time with it. Don't try and look cute though. Like, girl, next time I might be showing up in this hoodie and my t-shirt that's in my closet right now because I, I was like, let me wear the hoodie. Um, and no makeup, hair in a bun because you know what's going to happen? You're going to take a water bottle to the face like I did from Mithra. Thank you, Mithra, for that. <laughs> But yeah, though it was like literally so lit and there were some songs in there on the set list It was like it was like new beautiful to kill this love and um, Don't hate me. I didn't realize those were one of the first k-pop songs I ever listened to until it was on the set list and I was like listening to the set list I think before or when I was there. I was like Wait, I know this song, but I just like I don't know. There's like and this was like because I would listen to this was back 2014 2015 I would just throw like k-pop Pandora Radio, ew, Pandora, who still listens to Pandora, um, ew, um, <laughs> but I would do that and I didn't realize, like, I knew those, I knew so much more Epic High, because I never did, like, a super deep dive back, but during that time period, I was, I was, I was, well, I've always been invested in Epic High, you know what I mean? But, like, um, I didn't realize I knew those songs, like, it was such a cool experience. Also, I know I'm talking about, a lot about the concert. <laughs> I don't have a crush on Chablo, but... But, but, you cannot, you cannot, um, <laughs> it was, it was during the one, and you know the part of the chorus where it goes, you are the one, um, you cannot point at me and be singing those lyrics and be making eye contact with me during that, for not only the chorus, but also the post-chorus where you're like, you are the one, and I am the one, that, but you, you cannot do that to me without me feeling some type of way, okay? Also, there was like, I saw funny tweets. It was just like, I went to an Epic High concert, didn't expect to leave with a crush on <laughs> a husband and a father. <laughs> felt, felt, but I don't have a crush on him. It was just, it was, it was, it was just that. It was, just don't do that to me because I'm not mentally stable enough to have that happen to me. But anyways, <laughs> anyways I'm going to regret saying that. I know I am. Um, but like, <laughs> Um, but yeah, I'll, yeah, go to an Epic High concert. It's super litty. You'll get a water bottle to your face. Also, you might walk away with a crush on somebody you were never expected to have a crush on. But anyways, enough of that. We got Epic High, we got Screen Time, we got Hoshi. Really excited to see this collaboration with Hoshi. You know, Epic High always kills their collabs. Also, Hoshi does as well. His, he's just checking them off, girl. He had, he had, uh, Tiger JK. Now we get Epic High. Okay, okay, Hoshi. Okay, Hoshi. Which I also went to a 17 concert. Hoshi's, um, like an amazing performer my lord um and he is beautiful um so i'm really excited to be seeing this i don't you don't want to know my screen time you don't want to know my screen time we are not going to talk about it um but <laughs> we are we're just going to ignore that um we get really excited i feel like this might be one of their more like emotional songs like girl if i start crying let me cry um but yes you know what let go <laughs> Yeah. Ooh, and the the pop up of the text was awesome. Uh, the shot is holding on him looking down. Ooh. Okay. Okay. This video is sick. 
사실은 끊어졌다는 걸 모르고 다시 밤이면 지쳐 잠들 때까지 It's hard to let go 결국 우린 이별의 온도마저 다 너라는 옷을 벗고 가슴 시려 앞에 나와 아무 일 없다는 듯 지내는 널봐 I mean, and the bars are there. Bars are there, girl. Don't get me wrong. Oh, he's at a wedding. Ooh. This has to be one of their best music. I mean, they always have really good music videos, but... Yeah, this one's fantastic. Oh, that's crazy. Ooh. Two cuts, man. You gotta get out of the car now. Mood. I need a hug. <laughs> Myself. Wow. Okay, we're going to present. Oh, Oh, there's some projecting on the floor, too. I'm just trying to kill time. I'm sick of all the screen time. The lyrics always hit so hard. Ooh, they're always so like raw. charging right now that was powerful that was literally so amazing epic high think does it once again um this may be my new favorite epic high music video before my previous favorite one i mean they're all they are all fantastic don't get me wrong but the one with not the one featuring iu but the one with iu and crush uh the drinking one the uh what is it uh i know it's about like drinking your sadness away um that one i forgot the name of it it's it's uh it's not sober something it's i think it's like drink something um yeah that one the black and white it is so fantastic this one is i uh, may be my new favorite i think it's powerful the way that they showed it even just like the lighting like nothing is ever like fully lit within the visuals that they showcase here there's always it's like a light coming from the phone and like much more of like a spotlight situation kind of just like always whether it's like the flash on your phone or like just the phone the light coming from your phone um sort of the like the way the light emits from that so like the lighting was absolutely fantastic throughout i really really loved it was just really powerful even the flashing lights when like hoshi's in the club like even that can still be like flashing lights from like your phone and screen time whatever um so that was very very powerful also the different way that they use screens like when tablet is holding his hands and it's um like a screens there whether it's electronic parts whether it's myth or holding the phone and it's like the power or like the um, almost looking like Venom is going to choose his hand, um, or I guess, um, um, Mr. Electric would be a better, um, uh, well, Mr. Electric, what's his name? Electro? 
would be a better analogy for that one. Um, but yeah, it was very, very powerful throughout. Um, everybody's scenes really, really were. Um, so I really loved that. Um, it, what, with the visuals that they did. I saw, oh, the, the, my, I think my favorite one, there's so many favorites to pick out of here in terms of like what they did. But when it's Smith were driving and it cuts to the girl on the hood of the car, then it goes to Tableau and then it kind of comes out. That was a crazy camera move, but really, really powerful. Um, yeah, I brought by far one of my more favorite Epic High music videos. And um, there's always something about their lyrics that always just feels so like raw and like honest. And I'm definitely getting that here, um, especially with their more like emotional songs like this. Um, and I, I really, really loved it. I think it's great. Like the screen time, like it's a breakup. And so like when you're looking at, when it's talking about your screen time, it's looking at the past memories um, that you may have with somebody in your phone, like maybe like your camera picture or maybe social media or whatever. And you just kind of want the pain to the hurt to stop, but you kind of can't necessarily go away from it because you're always just so curious about this person, um, and what they're doing. Um, so yeah, I think that was very, very powerful. The lyrics are, I mean, they always are with Epic High. They always hit so, so different. It's been a hot second since they've released um, a much more like emotional song like this. So I think it was very much time with them. I know the EP has like a B-roll version it's called um, and also an instrumental, but also a voice only version. Talk about it. Like Epic High has been in the game like so, so long, but they can still figure out how to do something new and different versus everybody else whether it's you know their physical copy of their albums which are fantastic i highly recommend getting if you don't have one i have the epic guys here part one version i got our two guts photo card ah um, but yeah, no, literally super duper dope. Like I love their physical albums. Uh, that's the only one I have, but I really, really loved it. Um, yeah, also I forgot to mention the Pakubong. The Pakubong. <laughs> I'm so happy it exists. I need it. I will, I, I need the light stick. I need it. Like even if I never go to an Epic High concert again, which is never gonna happen because I think it's my new therapy. Um, I, I, I need the light stick. I, I need the light stick. Yeah, there's it's the best light stick ever in existence. Are you kidding me? Um, but yeah, I think the song was very very powerful. It definitely hits emotionally very very hard That's why I kind of shut up there at the end because I was just like paying attention to like the lyrics and everything that was happening Hoshi's vocals were so beautiful um, It was yeah, it really really worked for the song and the music video itself was so powerful and is I think my new favorite epic high um music video so yeah i i'm i'm in love with this i think the song is absolutely fantastic girl she is in the feels going into my crime playlist with all my other epic high favorite songs um but yeah no and again if you haven't seen epic high live highly highly recommend going to a concert those tickets are not very expensive compared to other artists and they tour a lot of different cities um so i still have to travel everywhere for my concerts but um yeah literally 10 out of 10 recommend um again don't look cute because water bottle to the face um but yeah so i i this is absolutely fantastic very powerful i i feel like i needed this i feel like also epic high it was like perfect timing especially with what we're getting um from artists these days but anyways go to put your thoughts and comments down below to that about epic high screen time featuring hoshi if you like this video this video a thumbs up if you liked me and want to see more of my videos go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you want to see my videos the second they come out hit that notification button if you want to follow me on social media twitter Instagram, TikTok threads, or in description down below, or at the end screen. If you like gaming content, I have a gaming channel. It's called Erica Just Games. Link to the description down below. I'm currently playing Resident Evil, so I hope you could join me over there for that. Thank you guys so so much for watching. Love you, and I'll tell you guys later. Bye.